but Somalia and Kenya because of the wisdom of our two head of states President Mohamed Siabare and Mzee Jomo Kenyatta we will solve them in peaceful manner without quarrel in a Somali Air Force plane. He was met at the airport by the Somali ambassador, Mr. Hashi Abdullah, and Kenya's deputy head of protocol, Mr. Mboya. This agreement, once it's finally reached, certainly would seem to be tremendously successful from the point of view of your government. It removes the immediate causes of tension. Yes. It doesn't, however, seem to strike at any of the root causes. Mm -hmm. One wonders, for example, whether at the end of all this, would you expect President Nairiri to recognize General Amin? You see, while I do not want to go into the detail of uh, recognition or non-recognition, you know, I, said, I said in my statement that um, the settlement will be tantamount to removing causes of tension and leading to amicable settlement of all problems between Tanzania and Uganda. I think I would like to confine myself to that part now and hope, uh, just to answer your question fully, that uh, there will be a permanent solution of all their problems. Would that permanent solution still be negotiated um, with you sort of in the middle? And, uh, yes, we are trying to uh, leave no stone unturned in making a permanent and firm solution.